This is the community's facility. The hub of our community. We take that seriously. It's every student, every day, every opportunity. Every opportunity I have is because of the education I receive. It's like putting together a puzzle, but with no end product in mind. We can also affect how teachers are going to influence students. I think it could be really, really big for Cuyahoga Falls. Educational visioning sets the tone for the curriculum and instruction that you want inside the building. What is the education that you want to deliver? And then you design a facility to allow that educational vision to come to life. It's especially important to keep an open mind because we are designing the building to your educational goals. As we set those goals, we also want to design a flexible building. So as those goals may change throughout the years, it's our intent to design the building as flexible as possible to adapt to, adapt to those in the future. Well, this morning we have representatives from our community. And really what we're doing is we're imagining. We're imagining what this might look like as we begin to think about transforming education here in Cuyahoga Falls. You know, I think it speaks to the importance of this project for a community that 100 people will show up to be invested in what our new buildings can be. And I think a lot of the conversations today are how we can bring the great things that are already happening and just really push them out and highlight them more. We were partially designing a new school for Cuyahoga Falls and there was a lot of talking. At first, um, we just did a bunch of introductions about everybody. Well, I got to meet a bunch of people that I, you know, I've never really talked to before. And then after that, we did an activity where we thought about what our successions about the new school was and challenges was. Basically, they were just showing us what we could possibly do with the schools, like different seating arrangement, different ways to give kids more hands-on experiences with learning, which I feel like is definitely something that needs to happen. There are a lot of cool things that I really hope that the school can put together to bring the best for everyone. We went around the room. There's a bunch of things that the new school will have, pretty much like a wish list. We talked about those. We get to see like the process of how it goes to set up building a new school. So we get to play around with it, to design it, how it would work. We're trying to get like a layout of the new school. I just find it fun. It's like putting together a puzzle, but with no end product in mind. Overall, it's been a really, really cool experience so far. Well, we have a lot of things that we want this to be. First of all, our uh, vision is Cuyahoga Falls City Schools, the hub of our community. We take that seriously. This is, as the mayor has described, the missing link uh, within our community, within Cuyahoga Falls. This is the piece that brings all of that together. The new building will be a six through 12 building. It'll be on one campus. So the building itself will be under one roof, and but we're meeting with the groups today to understand how maybe that building gets laid out. The existing facilities have some basic infrastructural challenges. So maybe they don't have air conditioning, or maybe the heat is very hard to regulate, or maybe the quality of the lighting or the air in the room. That can be really challenging for certain students. So that's one scale that we can make an impact on education is really, really the micro scale. But on the macro scale, we can also affect how teachers are going to influence students. If I was a student and I saw that my whole community was coming together to build a better building for me to be better educated, it would make me want to do better every day in that building. So for example, rather than sitting in a classroom all day, there's the potential that students would be able to experience different environments that can match the type of instruction that's happening. So they get to be a little bit more active and engaged and maybe learn in the way that they learn best. So not only will there be a brand new 6 to 12 building, it will be a beautiful campus setting. In addition to the academic side of the building, there will be a new performing arts center with a black box theater. And then there will also be a brand new athletic stadium on site too.
Oh, it's going to be cool because, like, if it finishes in 2025, like we predicted, then uh, I'll start my freshman year there so I can spend, like, my whole high school during that time. When this new school is done, I think it will have a lot more learning opportunities inside the school. I love the different dining ideas as well as the media center where kids can go to study. I think it could be really, really big for Cuyahoga Falls. I think a new facility, a new sports complex is really going to just bring a positive vibe to the, you know, the school district and everything around it. I'd like to have like a nice view over like the nice areas. I'm most excited about, if I'm completely honest, sports stuff. I've never played on a stadium. And if I try out for sports, I can play on a real live stadium. This is the community's facility. So we specifically designed the building for the community's needs and the district's needs. So they should be excited that they're gonna, they're gonna own this building. It's gonna be their building, it's gonna be designed for their needs, and they're gonna be proud of it. Well, we know that we have good teachers, and we know we have kids who like to learn. And we can only think that if we put the combination of those two things in a new facility, that only more good things are going to happen. This is where I went to school. I'm a 2008 graduate of Cuyahoga Falls High School. Every opportunity I have is because of the education I receive. Our mission statement is every student, every day, every opportunity. And I think that this building fulfills that promise to our community. And so for our students, Whatever you want to be, whatever you want to do, this facility will help you get there.